Hey, it's Meg from Meg and AJ, and in today's video, I'm going to be painting on a phone case. Um, this video did not go as planned. You're going to see why in a few minutes, so I'm just quickly sanding this down and everything. Um, and then I couldn't get my Jessica container open, so I'm just going to use white paint. That's probably not the best tool because Jessica is like a, um, what is it called? It's like... A, it's a primer, and white paint is just white paint. Um, so, it's probably my first mistake, but there are so many more to come. So, now that that's drying, I'm just going to test. Because I wanted to do this, like, blended background with an animal on the top, but, like, a drawn animal on the top. But I ended up doing something completely opposite. Um, this video had, like, three ideas in it, and it's kind of long it's almost 20 minutes so yeah so now that it's dry i'm showing you guys that it's it's dry but it because it's silicone um the paint doesn't want to adhere to it pretty well i mean it stays but when it's dry if it gets like even like a tiny tear it will break so i'm just gonna sand it down again um i'm gonna use a finer sand paper and the silicone it attracts a lot of dust and debris and stuff on it so i had to con consistently wipe it down it was it was kind of annoying here i am struggling to get the jessica container open um so i decided to use tape i don't honestly tape's pretty good so switching camera angles i'm just gonna paint the, i'm gonna paint the idea that i wanted to paint um yeah, this did not end up sticking like this. So this was idea number one. Um, probably not the best. So when I was doing this, when I was painting the bottom coat, bottom, the red, and that's the, right then is when I realized I kind of want to do like a like a, a spray paint ice cream. I don't really know. So I'm going to try a different approach i'm going to spray paint this um oh bad idea number two here taping the bottom don't do that no the felt will rip off and it will be even more of a mess <sighs> so here i am uh spray painting this is all like really sped up because if this wasn't spread up sped up this was going to be like 45 minutes long so i had to crazy speed this up um this is like this is at pretty much full speed and it's still kind of long so spray painting it works it's just not the best it's not it's it's fine but i would suggest not doing spray paint because it just doesn't stick too well, I guess. Um, oh, I forgot to take the audio out of that. Oh, well, I'll keep it on. So, bad idea number three. Don't touch wet paint. Please don't touch wet paint. I mean, there's nothing wrong with it. It just... It can sometimes mess up your design like it did right now. Like, if I didn't... If I just waited... It could have been, the, the phone case could have been done earlier, and it could have been pretty good, but no. I touched that paint, and then I just continued to mess, mess with it, and, hmm, um, trying to show you my idea. Yeah, no, so I ended up doing this. Yeah, this was two seconds after this was just spray painted, so I have no words. Um, so, why I moved over here is because, why I moved over to this table is because, um, there was a lizard, and I didn't want to go near it. But look, I spray painted and waited a fall day, right? Yay! So, yeah, so, you see, it, it looks like it's going pretty well, but then I do this. Yeah, I don't know, bad idea number four? Don't put tape on spray paint. Don't put tape on paint that you just put. Oh my goodness. Looking back at this, it. Oh, bad idea number five. 
don't put spray paint, don't put a different type of spray paint over a type of spray paint, because it does this, it, like, it bubbles up, I don't even know, um, oh, I forgot to show that, show this off camera, I, I did this off camera, but I sanded it, and then put a white base gun on it, and, um, I'm, I, I still want to stick with the, um, ice cream idea, because I really like it, it's just, um, it didn't turn out well, huh, almost done with this video, actually, halfway through, so, cool, um, yeah, I don't, there are so many bad ideas in here, um, I think this is, um, bad ideas had to come up really soon, bad idea number five, oh, this one, this one's, this one's not smart, um, this one's just me being dumb, so, it was going well. I should have just left it and kept it like this. Because if I just kept it like this, did a few more coats, and then put, like, a few more details on it, it would have been fine. Like, it would have been perfectly fine. But I didn't do that. Um, so I'm just painting this purple on. E yeah. Um. Yeah. So, I guess. Oh, now I'm painting... I don't know why, but I chose this, like, light yellow. Um, I guess let's listen to some music. Oh, wait, you can't hear it. Dang it. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Oops, you can't hear it. <laughs> so... Yeah. Um... Yeah. I have no words because I don't really know. Um, cool. Oh, <laughs> this wasn't a cut. I just forgot to paint this on camera. Um, that was... See, I should have just left it like this, but no. I decided to use fabric paint. Bad idea number five. Don't use fabric paint on a phone case or anything that is not fabric or a squishy. Don't use fabric paint. Why? What went through my head? It was fine. It was perfectly fine. I should have just left it like that. But I don't know. What did I do? I... I, I have no words. Why? That's all. That's all I can say. This is my only word. Why? Can someone... No, never mind. Watching this footage back, back like, back again, it... I don't know, it just... It hurts. I went through all this trouble and it looked horrible. Um, yeah. I don't know why I spent so long filming me putting paint on a phone case that, I don't know. Um, yeah. Please, don't use silicone. I don't think I can say this enough. Do not use silicone. Do not use silicone. And don't put fabric paint on a phone case. Please, learn from my mistakes. <sighs> oh, here's the part where I decided to put sprinkles on it. But, I mean... It's drops of fabric paint. Oh, oh, a sad part is about to come up. And it's, it, it hurts. Just watching this, it, it hurts. This, I don't know how, but somehow it got clogged. I only used this paint like once or twice. I only used that purple like once or twice. And I was searching for another purple, but that was the only purple. That was the only light purple. So I had to use it. And um, that happened. Of course it unclogs right when I needed it to use it. Um, thankfully, I could just peel it off and 
this part was kind of satisfying. But it also hurt because I used so much paint. And, oh, remember how I was saying don't put tape on the felt inside? Yeah, this is why. Um, If I could just scoot over a little bit to show on camera. I'll do that soon. Um, Yeah, see, 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 it just, it peels right off. Um, No. I don't know. Um. I, uh, I tried to put it, I tried to fix it, I tried to put it back on, but it just, it wasn't the same. Um, yeah. Why was I sanding the sides? I don't know. Sanding does not help. It is a silicone, it is a smooth surface. Sanding does really nothing. Oh, here's the part where it's a kind of good transition but kind of also not um yeah so when i realized that this was going to fail i bought a second phone case it was it, it was not a silicone phone case i learned from this mistake oh right so i'm gonna wait okay i gotta stop i gotta rewind a little bit and i just gotta explain what i'm doing i'm going to hydro dip this phone case if you don't know what hydro dipping is it's where you fill a bucket with water you put spray paint in it and then you dipped what you want to hydro dip in it and it comes out in this pretty cool design um so i've done this before i've done this a few times and they turned out pretty well so that's why i decided eh, why not i mean this phone case is already pretty much ruined and a second phone case is on the way um, it, it was, it was coming. Why? Um, this was probably the best idea I have ever had in this video. In this video, this is the best idea because this one actually turned out decent. Um, mistake number, I don't even know anymore. Yeah, gravity is a thing. Gravity is a thing. You can't just leave a gate door open and expect it to stay open. No! gravity <sighs> so they get closed i mean that wasn't that big of a deal but then i learned from that mistake and i put the bucket of spray paint and then i went to fill up my water um yeah <laughs> you can tell i spray painted before because this is the bucket i use for um hydro dipping and it looks gross um it was really dirty but whatever so i was gonna play music like non-copyrighted music obviously from like a youtube audio library that was i could just easily put but i don't know how to do that maybe 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 just maybe in the next video i might do that we'll see what happens um i'm, I'm kind of in a rush but i still want to make this vid uh, video good oh so this is going to be a two-part series because i did end up painting the other phone case and i'm actually wearing um putting the using this phone case right now as i'm recording this so the other one was pretty easy to make i mean it wasn't like really easy it took it took a it took a it took a little while to make but um it turned out so much better so i do like hydro dipping i mean it's it's fun but you have to make sure you don't get any paint on your hands because the paint will stay there for a little while. And if you are allergic to paint or whatever is in that, it, it probably won't be that good. Um, I, I, I know I'm not allergic to the paint or anything. I'm just, I've hydro dipped and I forgot to wear my gloves that I'm wearing now. So I got paint down to my elbow. Um... And it stayed there for a little while. It didn't want to come off. And so I ended up having to, like, pretty much sand it off. Not sand it off, but, like, scrub it off really hard and it, it hurt. So wear gloves if you're going to do this. Um, Just trust me on this one. I know I've made a lot of mistakes in this video, but this one, trust me. Yay! 
finally dipping. I'm only going to do one dip because, well, I need to get this video okay, edited. So the phone case is done. Here it is. I actually really like it. And there's plant stuff in it. Like grass, not plant. Um, like grass and everything is still kind of in it. I don't want to peel that off because I don't want to ruin it ruin it anymore so I'm going to seal it oh huh. oops okay um, I forgot that I kept the audio on that one see this is these are the things I painted these are the other things I've hydro dipped this one's my favorite um it just turned out really good and then there's one more which is my least favorite um I use these three I use the 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 cup for like a water cup and you know uh popsicle sticks and paint brushes and yeah so interesting but um i didn't immediately do that one i had a lot of practice because i i have like i use these wood pieces i don't know where the wood pieces are anymore I, they're they're somewhere um but i would practice hydro dipping on those and once i felt good comfortable i felt comfortable enough i would then start hydro dipping the other things um anyway i'm going to use this glossy clear coat on top to just seal the paint in so it doesn't um rip or crack um it does do that for the most part for this phone case in particular when i was putting my phone like on the phone in the phone case um the edges would start to rip so i put a few more coats on that it didn't really work but that's probably my fault this oh it's brands like liquitex or something um it's, it's it's good i really um i really if you're gonna do something like this or if you're just gonna paint something and you want to like top coat top coated or seal it use this uh use the liquitex okay now, i'll put a link in the description before i continue with this i'm gonna say that i'm not gonna have time to do this other phone case in this is this the video, second focus so I was talking about. to be a, a two part video where this is part one and then I'll do this one as part two. So continue with the finishing up on this. And just like that, it's done. Um, I'm probably never going to use the phone case as an actual phone case because of the fact that it's not the best protective phone case. I'm probably just going to put it on, like, a display or something. But I do like it. I ended up putting a, like, a, just, like, a liner inside. But, yeah, that's all. Um, I'll see you guys in two weeks. Bye!